and welcome to another Cyberpunk 2077 video. In this video, we are looking at the full legendary set for the Rocker armor. Now, I'm going to show the male and female versions of this because the male one works absolutely fine, whereas the female one, the outer torso, is bugged at the moment. Hopefully, that gets fixed soon. So, I've replaced it with a different item. So, first things first, we're going to get the pants. So, head down to downtown north fast travel point. Uh, that is the closest one around this item. Um, once you are there and you're on the right side, you want to head towards all the billboards in the direction I'm going now. I've literally just left the fast travel point. And then as soon as you pass that under passage, that little tunnel, uh, just pull up. Um, and on the left hand side, you'll just jump up. And you can either go through the door if you have enough body strength. Or you can just climb up and go over the top. Uh, that also works and that gets you the flame resistant rocker pants so that's piece number one now for piece number two head to uh, pacifica pier um or at least that's the kind of direction you want to be in now you actually want to ideally be on the freeway above that fast travel point uh, rather than the road below uh, so once you're up on the freeway itself um if this is your preferred option like mine then you can just jump through the gap uh, and as you can see down below, there's another road. That's where the fast travel point is. And you can just jump up from the grass verge if you want. However, if you're going this way, literally just follow the path, nice and simple, no real obstacles until you reach the rockers up on the stage. And there you will have the bra, if you're the female, or shirt, um, if you're the male versions. So that's piece number two. Okay, so now for piece number three, which will be the boots. So for this one, we're heading down into the city center, downtown. And the fast travel point you can go to for guidance or reference will be Skyline and Republica, which is down here, shown there. And then you can just come across and then hook a left up that first street. And it is straight up and it's a dead end, or you can turn right. And then once you're up this end, uh, just follow the water line back left and you'll come across a door you can either go through this door you don't have to uh, or down the right hand side and along the edge and then in for a gap makes no odds and this gets you the boots piece number three so there we go however i will just quickly show down the side there uh, just to show there is just a free opening so you don't need the strength now for piece number four you want to head up to the jerrys um, fast travel point which is in Santo Domingo down here on the bottom part of the map um, and then we're heading downwards underneath a bridge but I'll show you from the fast travel point so there's no confusion so once you're at the fast travel point just jump in your car quickest way to do this faster than running for sure uh, just head all the way down to the end of the street and once you reach the end you'll just hook a left into the car park that you'll see and then just in front of you, you'll see the bridge. And that's what we need to go under. So just uh, jump out, uh, run under the bridge, and then you want to hook a right. Uh, follow under until you reach the body on the floor, which has the aviators, which is piece number four. Job done. Now for the fifth piece, the bug piece on the females. And we're heading to Bellevue Overwalk which is in Watson Kabuki, the fast travel point there. So Bellevue overwalk and you'll be on a kind of overpass pathway. Uh, once there, you want to head up the next set of stairs you see on the left right there. So you're right near the fast travel point, up these stairs on the left and just follow it all the way through. And then you'll come to another body on the floor. And that body has the outer torso, which like I say, is bugged on the females, unfortunately. Um, it's, I don't know, it just scats out it sort of goes over the top of the shorts and then the leopard skin as you can see there the print just hangs out the back of the character uh, so those are the only pieces as you can see right there that work from this set so I had to improvise once again just to finish the set I didn't want my character running around in a bra and I used the bomber jacket the same bomber jacket I used on uh, a previous set build just to finish it off and that you can get from um, the strip club owned by the Moxes, um, where Judy works. And it's just in one of the cabinets there, and it comes in uh, uncommon, um, green, blue, or purple. It's totally random, depends on how lucky you are on your save, I guess. Um, so, yeah, if you want to use it on your female, you're going to have to find another top, the outer torso, as it does ruin it. However, like I say, it does work absolutely fine on the male character, so I will show that as well. Now, 
completely different look with your leather uh, trousers and your boots and your your waistcoat and your shirt that works fine uh, the hood is not part of it that's again me just putting an extra piece on just to finish it off but yeah i think it looks banging on the males so there we go um if it was helpful let me know like subscribe and i'll see you in the next one and as always stay safe <laughs>